hello everyone in this video we are going to see how to implement post call survey when using salesforce service cloud voice um, i have created and set up post call survey where once the agent disconnects the call the end user will be directed to a flow where it will ask the overall experience and if they and the agent can select one to five if they once the agent select one to five that particular value will be stored in this rating field which is of type number of length one in my voice call object or entity First, I created a subflow. So this is the survey flow that will be called when the agent disconnects it. I have enabled logging and I'm using store customer input. In the store customer input, I'm asking the uh, end users to select one to five for overall call experience. Timeout I have increased to 15 seconds. Maximum digits they can enter is just one. Next, I am using set contact attributes and I created a variable called rating value in which the customer stored uh, input will be uh, sorry, customer entered input will be stored. Next, I am invoking AWS Lambda function. Here, I am calling invoke salesforce rest api function these are all the parameters i am passing method name update record record id voice call id i will tell you how to um, create a variable and store the voice call record id in the next uh, main flow next uh, object api name voice call object destination key uh, another parameter rating underscore underscore C this is the API name of the custom field and the value will be rating value which we got it from this particular set contact attributes block timeout is uh, 8 so once this is done the call will be uh, disconnected for the end user let's see how to call this uh, subflow where agent can uh, enter the rating and uh, how this lambda function will be invoked to store it so this is my main inbound flow uh, in my phone number here for the inbound flow i have configured this simple inbound flow with survey i have set the logging behavior enabled and i am playing a prompt thank you for calling i am setting the working queue as basic queue I am calling invoke AWS Lambda function block. Here I am invoking invoke telephony tel integration API function. In the parameters, I am using method name as create voice call so that the voice call record will be created in Salesforce. Once the voice call record is created, we will be able to store the voice call record id because salesforce will return the voice call record id in this invoke aws lambda function block where we are calling invoke telephony api integration lambda function here i am setting i am using uh, set uh, attributes on current contact uh, namespace user defined and uh, i am using the key as voice call id the value will be set dynamically namespace will be external id and it will be voice call id once this lambda function is uh, um, executed successfully it will come to this set to contact attributes block here i am creating a variable called voice call id and then i am storing the voice call id from this invoke telephony api integration lambda function this is the value we are using it here voice call id for the record id uh, parameter okay so 
once the voice call record id is uh, created sorry yeah, assigned um, to this variable uh, next i'm calling set disconnect flow in the set disconnect flow i'm calling my su survey subflow so this flow will be called when the agent disconnects the call i'm doing this before transferring it to the queue please do not do this after transferring it to the queue we have to do this before transferring it to the queue since i'm calling this uh, set disconnect flow before uh, calling the transfer to queue block the call will be transferred to the queue it will be routed to an agent via omni channel once the agent assists the customer the agent will disconnect the call once the agent disconnects the call the service subflow will be called since we have set um, set disconnect flow here and then the end user will be able to enter a value for the overall rating experience and uh, it will assign the value to this rating value field and using uh, invoke uh, salesforce rest api function we are updating the voice call record id please check the video description in the video description i have shared my blog post from the blog post you should be able to get all the screenshots of all the blocks which will be very helpful if you are implementing post call survey in salesforce service cloud voice I hope it was helpful. Thank you for watching.